Hello and welcome. Thank you so much for joining me tonight. I am Holly Agnew, essential oil educator, eating psychology coach, uh, doTERRA wellness advocate, and owner of Holly Holistic Health. I am a former athlete having played sports all through high school and college. And to say I've had injuries is um, an understatement. So needless to say, I also have to share my sore muscles, aches, and joints and discomfort. So tonight we're going to be covering what can contribute to experiencing aches and pains, what can lead to inflammation in the body, and what essential oils and essential oil-based products can help reduce inflammation and aches and discomforts. So I need to make a disclaimer first, and that is I am not a doctor or a nurse, and that the products mentioned here are not intended to diagnose, treat, cure, or prevent any disease. So I started using doTERRA about 11 years ago, um, and about in 2016, I believe, I had um, my Achilles tendon repair. So this is probably one of my most impressive stories for the oils because they worked amazingly. Um, I had a tendon problem in my left foot, and I used um, a couple oils to help relieve the, the discomfort that I had in that foot prior to having the surgery on my opposite foot. And when I had the surgery, or actually before I had the surgery, the surgeon told me that this was gonna be the most painful surgery I'd ever had, um, that it didn't even compare to childbirth, which that's hard to do. <laughs> um, and so I kept using those oils because the pain in my left foot went away um, about two weeks before I had my surgery done. So I just kept using it because I didn't want it to come back. And so once I had the surgery for my Achilles tendon done, um, I still kept using it because I didn't want, I was on a scooter and I was pushing off with my left foot that I'd had um, the, the uh, tendon issue there. Um, and so after I had my surgery and I went back to see the doctor for a follow-up uh, about two weeks after my surgery, he's like, well, how's your um, discomfort? And I said, I don't have any. And he's like, no, really, how is it? I was like, I, I don't have any. The only thing that bothers me is there's something itching on the back of my leg. And it turns out he had lengthened my tendon and I had stitches there that I didn't know about. And that's what was hurting. So um, for it to do what it did, I thought that was pretty amazing. So has anybody else used essential oils for aches and discomforts? Yes, I have, Holly. Um, okay, can you tell me a little bit about it? Yeah, I would have um, nighttime um, cramps in my legs and um, wake up and just couldn't get my legs comfortable, um, aching and real restless. And I started using the deep blue stick with copaiba and I take um, the deep blue polyphenols one in the morning and one at night and I take a turmeric capsule at um, lunchtime and I'm not having any problems with the, the cramping in my legs now at night. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, so let's talk for a minute about what inflammation is in general. So there are two main types of inflammation. The first, they are acute and chronic. So acute inflammation usually occurs for a short time, yet it's often severe in duration. It often uh, resolves in two weeks or less, and the symptoms appear quickly. This type um, restores your body to its state before injury or illness. And the symptoms may include things such as heat, pain, redness, swelling, and loss of function. Chronic inflammation is a slower and generally less severe form of inflammation. It typically lasts longer than six weeks. It can occur even when there's no injury, and it doesn't always end when the illness or injury is healed. Chronic inflammation has been linked to auto autoimmune disorders and even prolonged stress. And long-term inflammation can lead to a, a number of symptoms and affect your body in many ways. And some common symptoms of chronic inflammation can include body pain, constant fatigue and insomnia, depression, anxiety, and other mood disorders, um, GI issues like constipation, diarrhea, and acid reflux, 
weight gain, inflama uh, and frequent, inf excuse me, frequent infections. And believe it or not, aside from the inflammation coming from an injury, one of the biggest culprits of inflammation is sugar. And it can be in the form of products made from regular white sugar or those that break down into sugars easily, such as processed foods, breads, and pastas. And I know when I eat too much sugar, um, my body will talk to me and let me know it uh, because my hips hurt more, my knees hurt more, and almost every other joint hurts more too. So some things that can contribute to inflammation are autoimmune disorders, exposure to toxins, um, untreated acute inflammation, such as an inflammation from an inf infection or injury, um, lifestyle factors such as obesity, ex exercising too much or not enough, and chronic stress to name a few, um, some medications and processed meats. And there are many conventional ways to treat inflammation that can lead to having aches and pains. And, and some of the ways to combat inflammation are um, to eat foods that are anti-inflammatory, like fruits, especially berries, and veggies, especially broccoli and mushrooms, as well as foods that contain omega-3 fatty acids, like fatty fish, such as salmon. Um, spices, such as garlic, ginger, rosemary, turmeric, and clove. Um, you can also cut back or eliminate foods that are pro-inflammatory, like trans fats, which those aren't as prevalent now as what they used to be, <clears throat> because they finally figured out that they're not good for you. Um, sugar, margarine, vegetable oils, deep fried foods, and processed foods. Um, another way is to con to control or to help combat inflammation is to control your blood sugar, um, make time to add movement to your day, lose weight, and manage stress. And all these things sound easy on the surface, but they're they're not always as easy as what they sound. But if you work towards um, at least one of those every day, you'll make some headway. So why make a change to using essential oils and other natural means? Um, NSAIDs like aspirin and ibuprofen can cause ulcers, GI bleeding, and other problems, heart attack or stroke, make blood pressure worse, or impair kidney function. And statistics show that painkillers are addictive and toxic to our organs over time. Essential oils have healthy benefits, as well as being able to be used for multiple things, medicinal or otherwise. Essential oils can help improve discomfort safely without side effects, and essential oils save money. And the thing I like about essential oils, they have a lot of side benefits, and we'll talk about some of those in a minute. Um, essential oils are, are powerfully concentrated, and many times one drop will take care of whatever you have going on, so small amounts are effective and work quickly. So what exactly are essential oils? They are naturally found in the seeds, bark, stems, roots, flowers, and other parts of the plant, and they can be used for a wide range of emotional and physical applications. It's important to remember that not all oils are created equal. Doterra essential oils are certified pure, tested grade, which means they contain zero fillers, pesticides, chemicals, or artificial ingredients. And most manufacturers do not subject their oils to the rigorous testing that doTERRA does. And that's one of the things that I really like about it because what it says on the bottle is what is in the bottle. So how do you use essential oils? The first way is to use it aromatically. You can um, use a diffuser, you can uh, use a spray bottle, something like this with my fancy label on it. And you can use that as a, as like a Febreze type thing to, excuse me, to um, freshen the air. You can just put it in your hands, rub your hands together and breathe in the aroma. You can also apply them topically. You can just put it where it hurts, um, but be aware that um, Anything that contains citrus oils, because there are some blends that contain citrus oils or citrus, citrus oils by themselves, uh, can make you more sensitive to the sun. So you need to apply at least 12 hours before going out or apply it where the sun don't shine. You can also take them internally. You can just put a, a drop under your tongue or you can use a veggie cap and doTERRA has their own veggie caps. And in case you don't know what a veggie cap is, 
it's this, and you just take it apart, put the oil in, and then put it back together. Of course, you want to hold it upright when you do that, but, and then make sure it snaps together, and then you can take it just like a regular pill. And that's an easy way to do it. I like to put my oils um, in, I like to make up some mixtures and have them ready, and then use a dropper bottle so I can get it into the bottle quickly or to into the the veggie cap quickly. So especially like when I'm sick, because I really don't want to count drops into a veggie cap when I'm sick. For safety, when you want when adding uh, to the wa to water, you want to use glass or stainless steel. Um, never put it oils in your eyes, ears, or up your nose. And if by chance you get an oil in your eye. You can use fractionated coconut oil, which doTERRA carries, and just rub it around the outside of your eye and somehow it pulls it out. I don't know how, but I've done it a couple times and it does work. And you want to make sure you dilute with a carrier oil um, to avoid sen skin sensitivities or with younger or, or, or older folks because kids and older adults are not the same as um, our age. So let's see what essential oils and products can help with inflammation and aches and discomforts. Uh, the best place to start is with nutrition. So the first thing I want to talk about is our lifelong vitality pack, which is our vitamin pack. It promotes general wellness and vitality. It provides antioxidant and DNA protection. It improves energy metabolism, promotes bone health, supports immune function, pr promotes <clears throat> cardiovascular health, supports healthy hair, skin, and nails, supports the eyes, brain and, brain and nervous system, promotes liver function and digestive health, supports lung and respiratory health, helps support um, joint health and function. So I know when I don't take these that my body hurts more. So I'm very diligent about taking them. Occasionally I forget and I pay for it later because it lets me know that I haven't taken it. Uh, next is our MetaPower Advantage with Collagen Plus MNN. And this is a powder that comes in these little sa sachets and you just mix it with water or whatever you'd like. I mix mine with water and I use a, a frother to help stir it up so it gets um, mixed in good. And then I just drink it like a regular drink. And <clears throat> so the MetaPower Advantage plus MNN helps to maintain healthy cell and organ function. It helps to keep you mentally energized. It promotes healthy weight and body composition. It contains nine types of collagen peptides from marine sources, which may improve skin elasticity, density, and firmness. It supports lean muscle and connective tissue, and it supports a healthy lifestyle regimens focused on increased energy, vitality, metabolic health, and weight management to add health to your lifespan. So <clears throat> this is one of the things I was talking about where you get extra benefits from using something. While you may be using this for one thing, you may notice other things are improving as well. Okay, so let's talk about some of the supplements and essential oils that can help. First is turmeric duo caps. So let me show you one of these just so you can get an idea of what I'm talking about. <clears throat> so if you notice, there is a capsule inside the capsule and that helps to, <clears throat> it get, combines the complementary benefits of turmeric essential oil with the joint support of the cu cu yeah, cu 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 cuminoids sorry, I had that word down until tonight, <laughs> of turmeric extract in a unique and convenient delivery system. It helps to support a healthy inflammatory response in the body, and it may help to fight free radicals and protect from oxidative damage. The dual chamber capsules are truly unique because they combine key ingredients together in one convenient delivery system, resulting in better turmeric absorption. You take two capsules per day, one with the afternoon meal and one with an evening meal to provide the joint and connective tissue support you need for your active lifestyle. And you can include in your daily supplement regimen to support 
healthy cellular, immune system, and nervous system function. <clears throat> Next is turmeric essential oil. And this, believe it or not, this is one oil that I use with my dog uh, because he has trouble with his spine and it helps him not to be in um, as much discomfort. <clears throat> so you can use it to get, um, me get metabolic support back on track. After strenuous activity, you can incorporate it into your recovery routine for a soothing experience. It may support a healthy nervous system as well as cellular function. You can take one to two drops in a veggie cap. And doing this on a regular basis gives your body the antioxidant support it needs to protect um, your body from free radical damage and support healthy immune function as well as immune response. And it supports healthy glucose and lipid metabolism. Next is co Copaiba soft gels and Copaiba essential oil. And Copaiba essential oil is something else that I use with my dog. Um, it is a great way to combine any oil, or it is great to combine with any oil um, to enhance its effects. Uh, you can promote, it helps to promote the health of the respiratory, digestive, urinary, cardiovascular, and immune systems. It's calming, soothing, and supporting, supported to the skin and nervous system. They possess strong antioxidant properties, promote healthy cellular function, may help support immune function while supporting overall circulatory health, and may help support the health of the gastrointestinal tract and colon. They have synergistic effect when used with other oils, which means it helps to enhance the effects of other oils being used with it. It helps to relieve joint discomfort and it helps to reduce inflammation. It also affects the sensory neurons to help block uncomfortable stimulus and it helps to reduce the negative impact of inflammation on cognitive function. Next is probably one of my most favorite um, families of oils or products that we have and that is the Deep Blue family. So this includes the Deep Blue essential oil blend Deep Blue Stick, Deep Blue Rub, and the Deep Blue Polyphenol Complex. So let's talk about each of these. Um, first is the Deep Blue Oil. This I like to use for smaller areas like a knuckle or um, a smaller joint. Deep Blue Rub, I like to use for larger areas like when my daughter um, broke some vertebrae in her back, I put this up and down her spine numerous times a day and it was easy to spread out and uh, was very calming and helped to relieve some of the discomfort that she was having. And new to the family is Deep Blue Stick. <laughs> so Deep Blue Stick uh, is like this, and you just roll it up and use it as needed. The thing I like th about this the most is I don't have to get it on my hands. So this, I, I love Deep Blue Rub, but when I'm in bed at night, I really like Deep Blue Stick because I can just take the lid off, rub it on my legs if I have cramps or whatever. And then within minutes, the discomfort that I'm having is relieved. So the, all the things that I just talked about uh, provide comforting, soothing, or excuse me, provides comfort, comforting sensation of cooling and warmth to problem areas. Uh, they help soothe tired muscles and joints. It contains plant extracts and moisturizing emollients that are good for the skin, leaving it nourished, soothed, and non-greasy after each use. It's great for a soothing massage. You can massage deep blue rub into fingers, arms, hands, neck, and shoulders for cooling and relief, relaxing relief. Not only will the tingling sensation of the lotion awaken your senses and rejuvenate your extremities, but the combination of CPTG essential oils will also soothe any affected areas. Uh, either of these is also great to soothe children's muscles when tense from growth spurts. And you can use for targeted temporary relief against simple backache, arthritis, sprains, strains, and bruises. And the last member of this family is the deep blue polyphenol complex. <clears throat> It includes 
frankincense extract, which can has been shown to help support muscle and joint comfort and function. It contains powerful polyphenols to aid occasional aches and pains and support uh, joint function and comfort. It contains resveratrol, which has powerful free radical quenching abilities. And the res resveratrol may help support the health of the brain, heart, and liver as well as the cardiovascular, immune, and nervous systems. And it has been clin cl clinically studied to promote healthy mobility and function and can provide soothing support throughout the entire body. So remember earlier when I was telling you about my Achilles tendon. So one of the, one of the oils that I used was lemongrass. So not only can you cook with lemongrass, you can use it for lots of other things too. It helps to in inhibit the inflammatory response in the body. It should always be used with a carrier oil as it's considered a hot oil, which means it, it, it excuse me, if you get it on your skin, it will feel like a hot pepper. <laughs> um, it helps to maintain healthy GI function when ingested. It's great for repelling insects. It can help soothe the body after exertion during physical activity. And you, you need to apply it diluted to muscle and joints for a soothing sensation for a tranquil massage. Next is helichrysum. And helichrysum reduces the appearance of blemishes and wrinkles, provides a soothing sensation for the skin and promotes a healthy metabolism. It promotes energy and vitality. It helps support the health of the, the digestive, immune, cardiovascular, and nervous systems. It can be used to promote healthy skin cell regeneration and a glowing youthful complexion. It helps to promote a healthy metabolism. You can use it to reduce signs of aging and may be applied to bruises. And for a soothing sensation, you can massage helichrysum into the temples and back of the neck as it has anti-inflammatory properties. Next is peppermint, <clears throat> and peppermint is the other oil that I used. So um, I put the lemongrass on first, then I added, and I rubbed that in, then I put the peppermint on and rubbed that in, and the peppermint helped to drive the lemongrass in. So the peppermint can be applied topically to relieve feelings of tension. You can layer it with other oils to enhance the oil's effects and to drive it into the body. Um, it promotes healthy respiratory function and clear breathing. It is great for cooking. It has a cooling effect when applied topically, and it provides or it promotes digestive health. Next is lavender. Lavender is widely used for its relaxing and calming properties. It helps to ease feelings of tension. You can apply to temples in the back of the neck to lessen tension and stress. It helps reduce anxious, anxious feelings, and it's also great for burns. <clears throat> and last but not least is marjoram. So marjoram can be used for its calming properties. It supports a healthy immune system. You can apply it to the back of the neck to lessen feelings of stress. It promotes a healthy cardiovascular system. It has positive benefits when used during a soothing massage, and you can massage it into tense muscles to help relax them after a workout or a long day. So let me try to switch to share my screen here, and I want to show you how you can get these amazing oils into your life. So this is me here. I am Holly Agnew. So you can get your own wholesale account with an option to renew annually for $25. And with that $25, you will receive a bottle of peppermint. So the bottle of peppermint itself is worth almost $25. It's like $24.50. So you're really getting your account more or less for free. You also have the option to buy through the loyalty rewards program, which is a monthly ordering uh, of one PV minimum to also receive 10 to 30% back in product credits to be redeemed for free products plus other perks. So these are the two kits that I recommend. Um, the first one 
is a healthy start kit. It has our top 10 oils. It includes of the ones that we talked about tonight, um, deep blue, uh, frankincense, lavender, and peppermint. Um, it also has a diffuser. And the other kit that I recommend is the Healthy Habits Kit. It has the vitamins, plus it has the deep blue rub, which I absolutely love. And it has um, frankincense and lavender, which are also great for aches and discomforts. <clears throat> And of course, it will be natural for you to want to share uh, your health success with family and friends. And there are easy ways for you to earn doTERRA dollars for free products or income through sharing doTERRA with family and friends. And to get the best price, you can go to my website, which is listed below, or you need to reach out to the person who referred you here. And if you have any questions, you can reach me at my email at holly at hollysholistichealth.net. And once again, I want to thank you so much for coming tonight. I really appreciate you being here. Please share this with your family and friends. And um, I am going to take this off a of record now. And well, that's my plan anyway. Let me stop sharing screen.